A little while ago, I filmed a video on how to create dates in Tableau using fields of day, month, and year. And I have just gotten a comment from a student on how to do this better. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do it in this video. Let's go. <laughs> So here we are in Tableau and I'm going to bring over the comment uh, and the comment is, sir, can't we simply use make date function? I think that's more clean and simple. Uh, so I looked at this function and I was like, yeah, it's so much easier. I don't know why I've been doing it the other way for like the last three years. No one has ever mentioned anything to me of like, hey, just use make date. So Krish uh, Cheda, which I think I recognize your name. Uh, I'm not sure if you're uh, one of my Udemy students, but yes. That is way easier. So thank you so much, Krish, for actually giving that tip. And it just reminds me uh, that, look, doesn't matter how good you get at Tableau or any software or anything we do, there's always things that we don't know. So it's good to keep an open mind and admit the fact that we don't know everything. I don't know everything. I'm still learning. So let's share with the world, Krish, this awesome tip. So let's go. I have got a data set here called Date Control. And if you want to follow along, um, the, there's a link in the description below, which will let you download it off my Google Drive. Here we are. So very important uh, to do this is to store the numbers you're going to be using to create the date as numbers. Very important. Now you can um, convert this to a number afterwards, but you know, obviously, hopefully it's easier if it's already done in your data set. So here we go, and we're going to go sheet one. And I'm going to create a formula. So create calculated field. Okay, and we're going to go date. Now here's the funny thing, Krish. I'm, I'm talking specifically to you. If I type in date, I always just notice this date. I never noticed this make date, make time before. I don't know why. Maybe I don't know if they added it recently or it's always been there. But eh, I didn't know. So what we're going to do is instead of using this date, which is kind of like pff, primitive, we're going to use make date, which is a lot easier. Let's double click that and we're going to go year, comma, month. And it's pr pretty much exactly like Excel. And I have been totally bad mouthing Tableau for like three years of saying, why can't they just use the date formula exactly like Excel because it's so much easier. And turns out that they have. Um, okay, I've typed them in, but they haven't converted. Oh, I think I know why. I'm supposed to press enter. So do that again. Year. There we go. Comma, uh, month year. So sorry, Tableau, for bad mouthing you for all these years. <laughs> it happens, man. It happens. Okay. So we go, okay. And now we have clean day and there it is. I mean, <sighs> I love days like this. You know, when you learn a function, you're like, it just saves you so much time. So that is pretty much it. That, uh, probably the shortest video I've ever made. Probably. So again, Krish, thank you so much, guys. Um, Anytime you see better ways of how I'm teaching certain things, let me know because then I'll do another video and we and together as a community, we can keep sharing all this knowledge and you never know. Some of this stuff can help out that um, the student who's just starting their computer science or a primary school student who's like wanting to know more about data. I mean, I never know who's watching these videos. So again, thank you and have a good weekend, guys, or have a good day, depending on what day you watch this. So bye.